In the heart of the serene evergreen forest, where the trees whispered secrets to the wind and the rivers sang lullabies, there lived a gentle deer named Daisy. Daisy was known throughout the forest for her calm demeanor and the magical aura that seemed to surround her. Animals from all corners of the forest would visit Daisy whenever they felt troubled, for a few moments with her could soothe the most restless of spirit. One day, as the sun painted the sky in hues of orange and pink, a small group of forest animals gathered near the great oak, their faces etched with concern. They spoke of a mysterious fog that had appeared at the edge of the forest, a fog that seemed to unsettle anyone who neared it. The animals feared the fog would spread, enveloping their beloved forest in unease. Daisy, upon hearing this, knew she had to help. She believed in finding calmness within, even in the midst of uncertainty. With her friends, Oliver the Owl, who was wise beyond his years, and Lily the Rabbit, whose speed was unmatched, she set out towards the fog. As they approached, a chilly silence fell over them. The fog was thicker than they had imagined, its tendrils creeping forward as if alive. Daisy closed her eyes and took a deep breath. Feeling the warmth of her heart spreading through her, she stepped forward. Her calmness like a shield against the fog, Oliver, with his keen sight, spotted a light flickering deep within the fog. There, he hooted softly, pointing with his wing. Daisy nodded, and with Lily leading the way, they ventured deeper into the mist. The fog whispered doubts and fears, trying to unsettle them. But Daisy remained serene, her presence a comforting balm to her friends. Finally, they reached the source of the light, a tiny glowworm trapped and scared, its light flickering in the dense fog. Daisy gently approached the glowworm, her voice soft and soothing. Why do you fear, little one? she asked. The glowworm trembled. I, I am lost, it said in a tiny voice. I wandered too far, seeking new sights, and now this fog, it scares me. My light feels so dim against it. Daisy smiled warmly. Your light is brave and strong, she reassured. Sometimes we all feel lost and our lights dim, but it is in those moments that we must remember our inner calm. It guides us through the fog. With Daisy's encouragement, the glowworm's light began to shine brighter. Its glow, warm and steady, the fog, as if sensing the change, started to retreat, dissolving under the light of courage and calm. Together, they led the glowworm back to the safety of the evergreen forest, the fog clearing with each step they took. The animals of the forest rejoiced welcoming them back with open arms and hearts. Daisy, with her friends by her side, had shown the forest that even in the face of fear and uncertainty, finding calm within can illuminate the darkest paths. The glowworm, forever grateful, decided to stay in the evergreen forest, its light a beacon of hope and calmness for all. And so, the evergreen forest remained a place of peace and serenity a testament to the power of calmness in overcoming fears. Daisy continued to be a source of comfort to all. Her gentle spirit reminded that within each of us lies the strength to face the fog and emerge into the light. As night fell over the evergreen forest, the stars twinkled above, echoing the light of the glowworm and the enduring calm of Daisy and her friends. The forest slept peacefully safe in the knowledge that calmness would always guide them through the shadows towards the dawn of a new day. The story of Daisy and the mysterious fog became a legend in the evergreen forest, told by the animals to their young ones as a reminder of the strength found in calmness. It was a lesson that transcended generations, a legacy of the gentle deer and her friends, who had ventured into the unknown and brought back light and peace. In the years that followed, the evergreen forest flourished, a beacon of tranquility in a world that often forgot the value of quiet strength. Daisy's legacy lived on, not just in the stories told around the fireside, 
but in the hearts of all who remembered the gentle power of calmness in the face of adversity. And as the glowworm continued to light the night, its glow a testament to the journey it had undertaken, the forest remained a place where any soul, lost or afraid, could find peace 